You know where we get in trouble as parents? When we tell our teens that they can't make good decisions out of one side of our mouth. And on the other side, we tell them, go pick a college, pick a major, make big life decisions. And by the way, we got $150,000 here burning a hole in our pocket that we want you to go out and play with. It's a confusing message and we need to get better at figuring this out. Listen to this clip where Laura Gosner Odding talks about teens and what's happening in their brains and what we're asking them to do. You know, when you were 16, 17, 18 years old, somebody said, pick a college, pick a major, pick a trade, pick a path, and you went, Okay, okay, great. <laughs> but here, okay, here's your problem. Super quick <laughs> yeah, age. Right. Exactly right. right. If you have enough life experience right. to do that properly. Not only life experience, you know what you don't have when you're 16, 17, 18, 22, 24 years old? A frontal lobe. Mm -hmm. Like the actual part of your brain that dictates good decision making, logical decision making. So we're asked to, to, to come up with a decision that's going to impact the rest of our lives when we literally do not have the capacity to make a good one. As a career exploration coach for 16 to 25 year olds, I hear parents saying this type of thing all the time. And by the way, they're saying it in front of the kids. Not always awesome. However, here's what we need to talk about. What Laura's saying is absolutely true. It's absolute fact. It doesn't mean that we can just skip past the 16 to 25 year old time frame so that they can grow brain. We can't do that. They still have to move forward in life. How do we help them do that? And I can tell you the best way to do it is to start having conversations, real conversations, and helping to guide your kiddo to figuring this out. Two thirds of teens that I talk to say that figuring out a career path and a college major is the most overwhelming part of planning for college. And it's the part that we're talking about the least. So let's help them make these good decisions about how to help them start to launch into the rest of their life. They can make good decisions. They just need a little bit of help and guidance from us. In fact, you can start having these conversations as early as elementary school. I know, call me crazy, but it works. If you're struggling with what to say to your teen, go out to my bio and download my career conversation series. It'll help you with all kinds of activities that are gonna help you have really meaningful conversations with your kid and feel like you're making progress. You're amazing. Get out there, have those conversations with your kids. You got this.